Hello there, Inglewood here from Killing Esports, doing a Let's Play of Breath of Fire 4. The RPG from the PlayStation 1, uh, sequel to one of my favorite games ever made, which was Breath of Fire 3, obviously. And I'm just gonna jump right into this while I talk. Um, this is my fourth time starting this game, because my audio levels were really screwed up the first three times that I attempted it. Uh, but I finally got them figured out. I found an appropriate level where I can actually sit back and mumble nonsense and it's still audible. Uh, but you can also hear like the game sounds and music and all that as well. So now that that's figured out and I've wasted several hours watching this same intro over and over again, uh, we're all squared away. So we should be good to go. Uh, I, I assume I'm going to take this all the way to the end. I, I've never played this game before, so I'm going to be running around like an idiot and doing things wrong, and that's kind of unavoidable, I guess. Um, what else? So, uh, so yeah, so please bear with me for being terrible. Uh, I've also got the text speed on fast, and that's just because I kind of read fast and I skip through it and I catch it all. But if you guys are reading it and you're like you're missing stuff that's being said and you don't like that, just let me know. And in the future episodes, I will not be smashing the button to skip text as quickly as I am now. And at some points, I can't actually control how fast it goes. It kind of lingers on screen, so you'll see sometimes it's fast, sometimes it's slow. I can't get around that. So anyway, let's jump into this. Here in the middle of the desert on a... Uh, sand skiff with lizards nearby. Chapter 1. Awakening. Oh, and another thing that kind of bears mentioning. I, I bought a really cheap wired Xbox 360 controller because all of mine are wireless and they don't work uh, with the PC. The PC. The PC. And obviously I'm not going to play this with a keyboard and mouse. I, I tried it, it was ridiculous. So I, I bought a cheapo controller and it really sucks and it's loud. And so you're going to hear me pressing buttons because this thing is like one piece of plastic. Uh, and sometimes running is difficult because I have to hold down the button really hard. So it's pretty ghetto. Uh, but I guess that's what you get for watching Let's Play videos of 12 year old games on the YouTubes. So here we go. I'd heard there was a dragon in the desert, but I was hoping we wouldn't be lucky enough to find it. Now, uh, Nina is obviously Nina from Breath of Fire 3, and Cray is obviously Ray. Um, now, maybe it's not, maybe these aren't the same people at all, but they look the same and they have the same names as the Breath of Fire 3 characters. But like I said, I never I never actually finished that game, so perhaps there was more to it. Or maybe the game designers are just really not very creative with their naming conventions. Blast it. Ting tang. And Nina is not very helpful at all. So, we got bit slapped by a dragon, but it abandoned us. And we can't fix it without any spare parts.
If we leave our sand flyer here, we run the risk of bandits coming and hooking it up to a tow truck and taking it away. Or repairing it for us and then stealing it. But Nina... No, it's fine, Cray. I will go. All right, all right. Sarai to the south. Okie dokie. The king's sword. But I can't even use the king's... Shut up. Just make sure you don't give it to anyone else. It's mine. And we are off. Oop. Or not. It's Mario. On a chocobo. <laughs> and she immediately starts rummaging through his shit. It's like a giant cock and balls. Look at the chest. <laughs> uh, I somehow didn't notice that the first three times I watched this. Show us that cock and balls. Come on. It's not attacking? Oh, it's a monster. Oh. And it's gone. Whoa, it's tiny, micro penis. I'm sure you can go rob that vendor of his clothing. I don't know, bitch. I'm just a streaker. I don't know what you want me to say. Ryu. I made this rope out of my pubes. Here, take this sword that I have no business giving you.
monsters. Don't look at my ass. On to the cliff. Two steps later. That's actually pretty high damage for a level one fight in a game. 100 damage apiece. Not wasting any time. goo this time. Yeah. Six zenny. We're rich. Got that goo money. Oh. Oh no. There's this gigantic hole in the path. All you have to do is walk across it. Yeah. That was tough. See, it's easy. Ignore these giant wings on my back. He jumps off with her. That's good. He's a nice guy, that Ryu. And apparently falls faster. Very brave. Very heroic. Let me thank you with a blowjob. Now, the first few times I ran through this, I spent lots of time walking around, checking corners, trying to find secret loots and whatnot. Um, and I'll, I'll continue to do that once I get to a point where it's fresh game for me again. Uh, but for now I'm just kind of beelining it through the story for a minute just to get caught up to where I was before. Because I don't feel like pretending like this is fun. Because it's not. Um, I'm not sure how long I'm gonna make these these uh, segments of the let's play I'm thinking like 15 or 20 minutes um, but a lot of that is going to be dependent upon when and where I can find save points obviously and I think regarding fights actually what's going on here some bees came out of a trap door couple of really big bees. And a anthropomorphic furry. Let's 
So, the time hath come. It would appear that something is amiss. Thy return, tis not of import. There be more pressing matters to attend to. Canst thou not sense it? Canst thou not sense how very old I am? shall meet at the appointed time when the time hath come okay so ew. ambrosia and homeboy turned into stone that's pretty nice all right, whatever. Old dude, old dude goes on an adventure. Ugh, just cross the goddamn. Hey man, who goes there? What be ye doing in this place? The legendary dragon of the farts. Pikachu! Oh, he looks familiar. Look at that cock and balls on his neck. Oh, yeah. This be a dragon. I'm yeah, I just realized I was skipping that text really, really fast. I don't want to do it that fast, so I apologize. Meanwhile, back at the cave. Uh, dragon made a mess. save here yeah I'll save so that's gonna be the end of chapter one thank you for watching uh, now that we're all on board chapter two will begin immediately